uh, right now I'm looking for foreigners for my YouTube channel. And uh, what I do is I get foreigners eat Japanese food and then take their reaction. <laughs> So like not like uh, bugs or insects or anything like that. Like with actual Japanese food, and uh, you don't have to pay for food. So like there's no catch to it. I have close to almost 50k subs on YouTube. Okay. If you have time, it doesn't have to be today. It could be another day. Would you be interested? <laughs> sure. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's great. So uh, you can check and see if it's legit or not. Go ahead. Yeah, like I have, I have one video that's almost close to one million views. So, wow. awesome. Where are you guys from, by the way? I work from Canada. Oh, from Canada? Oh. Yeah. I grew up in Canada. Oh, yeah. 19 nice. years. Where about? Oh, sorry, we're from Alberta. From Edmonton. Well, Alberta? Yeah. Oh no way! Yeah. My parents used to be in uh, Calgary. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Where did you? Do you uh, grow up in Calgary or uh, Vancouver. Vancouver, British yeah. Columbia? Yeah. Yeah. Real. Yeah. <laughs> it's real. Yeah. <laughs> yes. 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 Wow. Cool. Yeah. So, yeah. You if you're up for it, yeah. how long? Uh, or in Tokyo? Just five days. Five days. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, how many more days do you have left? Four. Yeah, four. Four days. Also, oh, you got here yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Is it your first time? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure in Alberta you get a lot of Japanese food too. Yeah. Like. Probably pretty generic yeah. versions of it, but yeah, like it's not like it's California not like, roll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you have anything you are interested in and in trying? Because that's all we usually do. Like we ask people what they like to eat, and then we just give them uh, <laughs> nothing that we were particularly interested in. No, yeah. Like I think we did obviously just like you want to eat sushi that's sushi. like from Japan from and Japan. like gonna be fresher than what we get in the prairies in yeah. Alberta and we did want to go and see if we could have uh, like go to a steakhouse and do oh, steakhouse. a Japanese style mm. steak uh, oh, which okay. would be nice and then I don't know whatever like, else uh, we saw that was interesting or, Japanese or then, yeah, so yeah. like a uh, teppanyaki have you had that mm -hmm. like, yeah. yeah teppanyaki in Japan is a little different than the ones from uh, North America okay. where they don't do any of these you know oh, right like circus yeah. shows like you don't do that in Japan so that's probably for the best. We can, yeah. we can live without that, but yeah. Yeah. If you want to try that, we can, I mean, we've done like videos there. So, or if you like to try sushi, which is, it's not like rolls, it's more of a nigiri. Right, okay. So, we can do any of those. I don't know. Sure, yeah. yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. We're gonna be picky. I think, honestly, we did kind of want to come and be pretty open to food and just kind of see stuff and say yeah. you want to try that and just kind of eat as okay. much as we could because <laughs> okay. it's such an interest like you know it's such a it's so different of, like yeah so okay. we're, gonna go get yeah. we're gonna go eat food right now yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you what are you eating we're i don't know we're just gonna wander around and we're, find somewhere like conveyor belt thing, but oh you're, you're planning to go to conveyor belt if you haven't had food yet and if you're hungry <laughs> you're gonna do it now sure <laughs> yeah we're megan and connor we're from uh, Canada, Alberta, Edmonton, and we've been here just for a day so far. Yeah. yeah, so we're in town for five days, and we actually came with one of our main goals was to eat as much Japanese food as we could, <laughs> and wander around and experience everything that we could, so this was a pleasant bit of happenstance to run into you, and, uh, and get that opportunity, so yeah, people can, can see our experiences firsthand along with us. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds great, and then I hope I can, uh, you know, make your wish come true with all that. Eating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, we're well on our way already. So yeah. yeah. All right. Are you guys excited for uh, actual, you know, counter sushi? Yeah. Yes. Very, yeah. yeah. We we do get some of it in Canada. Uh, like enough. Uh, I'm sure there's enough Japanese people that we get some that you might consider authentic. <laughs> but it still to to have it's it here would be diff enough, would be different. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. so let's get going. Yeah. Sure. Let's go. Are you a big drinker? Like alcohol or just alcohol, general? Alcohol, yeah. Yeah, we drink. A little bit? Yeah. Okay. Would you be interested in trying some sake? Sure. sure. Yeah. Yeah, usually in the winter time it's warm and then summertime it'll be cold. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, how hungry are you? Well, I'm pretty sure you were looking for food to eat, so... Yeah, yeah, just... Like, moderate? The whole amount is good, yeah. yeah. Not like starving, but we can okay. definitely both eat. Sure. And what kind of like fish have you tried in 
Alberta. Well, we get like obviously salmon and tuna, although not like like the tuna we get would be pretty limited. Like yeah. it wouldn't be any albacore, like, maybe. Yeah, red tuna. Yeah. But maybe you might see some <laughs> like yellowfin, but yellowfin, like not yeah. not much. And then like, like eel. eel and oh, you occasionally eel. mackerel, you'll see. <laughs> Unagi. Unagi. Yeah. And then we always get like, because it's just fake. In imitation crab is like polished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, never yeah. Get, you never get real <laughs> in Canada, <laughs> especially okay. not Western Canada. Eastern, <laughs> Eastern Canada has lots of yeah. like shellfish, but and crab yeah. and mussels. Like all the seafood's really good. Oh, this is sake. Yes, it's Japanese sake. Mm -hmm. This is a famous Japanese sake called a uh, dasai, mm -hmm. and maybe in. Canada, they have it too because it's really famous now. Probably, yeah. You're getting, a, you're seeing a lot more of it. You can buy a lot of a lot of the whiskey now too. You see, Yamazaki. pretty large, dis uh, yeah, Suntory, and yeah. you see a lot of selection. Yes. Do you guys know Kanpai in Japanese? Kanpai? Mm -hmm. Do you guys know? Okay, nice to meet you. Kanpai, Kanpai, Jos. Yeah, yeah. That's very nice. The few other times that I've had sake, it has not <laughs> been like that. It's not like, like vodka. Like, yeah, yeah mm. just harsh mm. and yeah, kind of flavorless. It's almost this just is like a ice wine here. Like. Ice wine, yeah. yeah. It's a bit sweet, like, mm. kind of, oh yeah, because of the rice. Mm. Yeah. Do you usually, like, you sip it, right? You, you sip it, yeah. Okay, so I was like, I'll throw it back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, to it's find actually a bottle, yeah. pretty cheap. Hmm. You can get like in a smaller bottle too. Like you don't have to get one of the big ones. Mm. Yeah. So. It is cool too. Like the, you go to like Seven Eleven and you can buy like oh yeah, like, everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, it's like a full meal basically. Yeah. yeah. Did you eat like on your first day? Did you go to convenience store? Yeah, we yeah. got in pretty late last night, and so mm. just picked up something to kind of eat in the hotel room. We were, oh, yeah. we were tired and didn't. Yeah. Yeah. So, the packaging yeah. school though. I had like this little like it was like a onigiri. No, 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 like it was right. It was like a sushi, but it was like in a triangular shape, and it had like mayo, tuna, tuna and mayo in the middle, and then it had um, seaweed on the side. Oh, yeah, but the way yeah. you peel it is so like yes. the seaweed's completely covered. It's called uh, onigiri. Onigiri. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. peel it off. Yeah. Peel it, and then you like pull, pull the sides. Yeah, 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 it was so cool. Yeah. The burrito actually tastes really good. So we ordered some uh, red tuna, mm -hmm. and we ordered the belly part of the tuna. And then we also got part. flounder. Oh, okay. And I've never, I don't know if I've ever eaten flounder. I have a friend, I have a, I went to school in Miami yeah. and I have a lot of friends who do like aquaculture. Okay. Just happen to be the guys that I met. Yes. And one of them farms flounder in Ooh. Florida. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. It's pretty interesting. The other one does, does clams and, oh. and other kind of, and uh, mussels too. Yeah. <laughs> and then we're going to have sea bream. I don't and think uh, uh, it's kind of like a red, it's kind of like snapper. Either. Okay, yeah. Snapper, yeah. So it's similar, but a conger eel. It's a eel, it's the same as like unagi, but it's a different type of unagi. Is it For taste sushi, different? slightly. Okay. So what brought you guys to Japan? <laughs> kind of a long <laughs> story. Our friend is getting married in the Philippines. In Philippines. So we're going to the Philippines after this. Oh, well, actually, we're going okay. To Bali and the Philippines. Oh. <laughs> but we, uh, Stop yeah, over. We, we, yeah. It was about cheaper actually to come to Tokyo, and we always wanted to do Japan, so we got six days out of it, and then we fly down to Vietnam and then Bali and then the Philippines. Wow. So, <laughs> yeah. It's quite a long trip actually. Overall, it'll be about 24 days. We actually wow. got the time off work, so. Oh, that's good. That's, that's good to work. Do yeah. Your company. Yeah, <laughs> do it while you can. Yeah. It wasn't our plan initially, um, but the the flight was cheaper and more convenient too. It is nice to have like not have a sixteen hour leg or something yeah. like that if you fly through Singapore or like there is some direct flights to Manila, uh, Vancouver. It's a long ways too, yeah. so it's nice to break it up. And then we figured if we were going to be here anyways, yeah, take a few days and. and yeah, that's good. We're actually going to Korea, South Korea, for two weeks in August. August. Oh, in August, too. Yeah. <laughs> so we're coming, coming right back to the side of the world after not never coming in 30 years. Uh, yeah, twice twice in six months. Yeah. Hi. So this is savory, and this one is flounder. So these are red tuna. This is the red meat of the red tuna. And this will be the fatty part. And 
I don't know if you have salmon eggs. I don't know if I have. I've had raw, but. Yeah, this one is salmon eggs. Okay. Oh, and the one close to you, this one is uh, Anna Rolf. That was the corn meal that I was talking about earlier. Yeah. Sure, he does. It looks similar. But... Yeah, it looks similar, but it's slightly different. But it's soy sauce. And then you can use your hands in Japan for sushi. Oh, okay. Yeah, you don't have to use uh, chopsticks. <laughs> Before we eat in Japan, we have a word that we say. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of like saying grace, Japanese version. And uh, it's called itadakimasu. But the way to remember or to say it is eat a duck or a mouse. If you say it fast enough, it just sounds like it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Yeah. 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 You can try with the flounder first. Sure. Yeah. That's okay. And then there's wasabi inside, so just heads up. Oh, it's inside. Okay. Yeah, this is real wasabi. Oh. And then the way you dip it is you tilt it and you put the, the fish side okay. into mm, the soy sauce. So you don't get as much. Is it one bite? Mm. One bite. Mm. It's very light. Yes. It's nice. You can tell the wasabi has like, a, <laughs> still spicy for you, but you can tell it it has like like a horseradish. The the fake wasabi has a very overpowering like it's spicy, it's harsh. But this is spicy, but it has like a little more depth. Yes. It does. Yeah. It, it, it adds it adds to it. It doesn't overpower it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But that fish is very very light. You don't yeah. taste much of it. Yeah. But that's flounder. Sounds very good. Sea mm. breeze next. Sure. The white one. The white one. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's nice as well. Plain. Even the soy sauce tastes different too. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's it's richer. Mm -hmm. Like they make their they blended their own. So like mm -hmm. we do it at the same time? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, that's really good. Mm. Yeah, it's flavorful. And just it's funny because you can tell when it's fresh because it tastes less fishy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Like sometimes yeah. with sushi with like the raw fish, you're like in in Canada, you're like. We don't need to throw all of Canada under the bus <laughs> in, in, Alber in Alberta, in, yeah. in the prairies, yeah. <laughs> Is that a different type of egg? It's a different type. Mm. So this is the fatty part. That's the fatty part. Yeah. That's actually one of my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> it just melts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I've, I've definitely never had a piece of tuna <laughs> like that. That's so nice. Yeah, the flavor is so mild and it's it like just it melts. Yeah. Like, it kind of has that same, it not, doesn't taste the same, but it melts when it's like really good. Yeah, it's when it's really fatty, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. This one smells quite different. Yes. And the color is slightly more yellowish. It doesn't smell sweet. Anymore. No, it's much less fruity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a bit more dry. Yeah. It's, like tough, about it's tough to describe. Well, <laughs> we are. Like, it's same thing. It's made with. I'm getting hints. <laughs> you can try this one next. Oh, the, oh, no mind. Okay, I'm not as nervous as those. <laughs> I think, like I think you'll like this eel more than the other one. I bet it'll be. <laughs> Just a little bit. Yeah. That's so tough. That was nervous about the one bite. That was small. <laughs> 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 
Okay. Very salty. Mm-hmm. It's different. Yeah. Initially, the texture is a bit weird, though. Texture, yes. It's, it's like, the, like eating boba. Yeah, it's like a little on the slimy side, but it's good. <laughs> so, this one you don't have to put any soy sauce just on its own. <laughs> I'm excited. I, I really like yeah, eel generally. It's eel. one of my favorites. I'm, I'm less eel. Mm. Yeah, that's really nice. <laughs> it's like it's creamy almost. Yeah, that's better. So now you find it a little more fishy. It can be fishy sometimes. Yeah, whereas that was a lighter flavor, mm-hmm. and then you just get the the grilled kind of flavor. Very nice. Tastes like a you know, like a like a white fillet of a fish. Oh, yeah, Almost. Maybe a little denser, but yeah. yeah. No, no, no. We've never, I think one of the things that we've definitely never tried that we know is common is, is the urchin. We've never tried that. Mm. Would you like to try? Um, yeah. Will I like it? <laughs> well, if you don't like it, our channel is not everything that you all like. Mm-hmm. We do both. So We can try it. Yeah? This, I like the other stuff a little more. Yeah? <laughs> this one's a little more yeah, alcohol is. heavy. It's still like a dinner. It doesn't burn though. No, it is not, it is nice. smooth, but. Mm-hmm. So, this one's sea urchin, the one you had. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And remember we had that fatty tuna? Mm-hmm. There's actually three different kinds to it. There's uh, toro, which is just fatty tuna. Mm-hmm. And there's medium fatty. And there's like super fatty which is this one Ooh, okay the one we had earlier was medium fat okay so we'll probably like that one this one's more fattier and that'll be the same and this fish is called king medai in japanese king medai is actually golden eye so i guess golden eye savory might be mm. the word for it <laughs> okay yeah you can try with the that one has a bit more flavor than the, mm-hmm. the other the green, yeah. yeah. I really, I actually like the texture of the skin. Like the there's skin? like a little strip of the skin. I actually yes. like that. I was mm-hmm. concerned that I would find that weird. Mm-hmm. No, you don't have the skin. You yeah. Three of the other ones. He probably don't eat it because he said he's getting old, so he can't eat one of the. He can't eat a lot, and I don't think he's gonna eat anything that's more like fatty. Mm. Heartburn or whatever? Yeah. This is the one we already had, the red yeah. pepper. Yeah. Oh, I know, I like it already. So. And if you wanna. Have the uh, uni at the end. Sure. For the last. I was gonna say it for the last. <laughs> Alright, a fatty one. Sounds a good one. I don't know, I was gonna say if it's fatty. Yeah, that's the, the best part. You can see it's like. <laughs> it's like the wagyu. Apart. Oh, I was gonna say the wagyu one. It's got like the weight. Mm-hmm. So good. <laughs> yeah, it just absolutely melts. Yeah. I eat a lot of yeah, flavor. Yeah, it's so mild. This fish actually is like that fatty though, compared to like meats and stuff. Meats and stuff, yeah. Would it be like similar? Well, like if you're having Japanese A5 wagyu, it's a lot more fattier. It's like yeah. you don't even need teeth to eat it. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's so melt. soft. <laughs> <laughs> What's the flavor gonna be like? Um, it really depends on the store. Um, sometimes it'll be like really ocean taste, <laughs> okay. which is you know like a seaweed, like really strong seaweed flavor. Um, okay. Sometimes it's just more creamy and less of that seaweed taste. It's easier to eat. It's it's raw, right? Like it's not cooked at all. It's raw. I've seen they like they catch them and crack them open yeah. and just eat it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and then just Dip a little bit of soy sauce. 
the texture is much different than what you expected. It's so creamy. <laughs> it's almost like a like a paste. Like it just yeah. you don't have to chew it at all. It just it's quite quite nice actually. It's a little <laughs> bit sweet almost. Like yeah. 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 I try to be chewy. That's not what I thought that was gonna taste like. It's <laughs> that's quite that's really nice actually. I didn't find it had that strong of a taste though. So. No. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, almost a little sweetness. And yeah. Okay. This is definitely that's good. Oh yeah. I was like I was expecting <laughs> I was expecting a little more fish. Fish yeah. AC taste. Yeah. Well that was nice. Yeah, this is actually a delicacy. Mm. 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 Yeah, no, that, that was really good. Yeah. I didn't find it had a lot of taste in it though. I might have to keep going. Is it, do you ever put like the seeds like upside down so you get on your tongue? Like the fish part first? Yeah. The fish part first because you get that flavor of the fish and then also the soy sauce too. The reason why we put soy sauce onto the fish is because when you dip the um, rice, it, the rice it will just like fall apart. The rice will fall apart mm. into the soy sauce. So that's why. Like we lie on the sushi falls apart. <laughs> well, we also only really get like, like rolls, so yeah. yeah, you don't really have a choice. <laughs> Would you like to try uh, fatty tuna, congri eel, you know, anything you want to repeat? I'm pretty full, actually. <laughs> you're pretty, pretty <laughs> yeah. full? Yeah. yeah. If you're full, I mean, you don't have to be shy, because <laughs> if you can still eat, oh, might as well. <laughs> no, I'm, I, I'm okay, I, I yeah, that was, that was excellent. Yeah. yeah. We're used to like... One set of sushi, like well, like six sushi rolls, and we're done. Uh, <laughs> usually eight near the end of the meal. Uh, we usually eat yes. for sushi. Yes. Depends what meal you're having. Yes. Because in Japan we have like a set meal sometimes that we eat for lunch. Like you get a bit of pickles, uh, boiled rice, uh, miso soup, and then like a main dish. And what we do is we take a bite of that main dish. And we eat our fish, and then we take right. some rice, and then we drink some miso soup. We kind of alternate. Mm. So I guess, uh, what was your favorite? The fatty ones. The fatty, the fatty ones. Yeah. I actually think it was the urchin. It was really? Like that was just such a unique flavor, I, and, and because <laughs> it was, and because it was surprising too. I think it, it like. It, it made it that much more like I, enjoyable. I was too scared Whoa, to like, enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it did surprise me. It was good, but I was just nervous that it was just going to be like. Just it was really good. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure if you eat sea urchin back home, it will not, I think it's not taste not like it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm it keep it to maybe delicacy maybe. here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, that might be a good idea. Yeah, yeah. and that eel was just quite nice. Eel, yeah. The, mm -hmm. I don't like the you know, at home really. Mm. Now you know. No. Now I'm hungry for you to eat anything. <laughs> raw was still maybe. Yeah, and raw maybe was. Raw. I think it's more the texture, and yeah. it's very salty. I found. Yes. Yeah. Go to some of this. Some of this stuff. Some of this stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the meal. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you so yeah, much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, please enjoy Japan. Yeah, we, we will. Yeah, have. thank you. More so because <laughs> yeah. of this. Yeah. yeah. Thank All you, right. Guys. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.